All right, in this video, we're going to look at finding some arc lengths of parametric curves. So in part A, we've got the absolute value of 6 minus t uh, equals x, and then y equals t. And we're going to evaluate this from uh, 0 to 3. So we'll have to integrate from 0 to 3. We'll take the derivative of x with respect to t squared plus the derivative of y with respect to t squared dt. So notice uh, for x equals the absolute value of 6 minus t, we can actually just say this is the same thing as 6 minus t for t on the interval 0 to 3. Because uh, if you take any value between 0 and 3, uh, the 6 minus t will stay positive. So we can just remove the absolute value. Well, that says the derivative of x with respect to t then is just going to be negative 1. And that tells us the derivative of x with respect to t squared is just going to equal positive 1. The derivative of y with respect to t, that's also just going to be positive 1. So the derivative of y with respect to t squared will also just be positive 1. Easy enough. So we've got the integral from 0 to 3. We would just have 1 plus 1 dt. Well, that's the integral from 0 to 3 of just the square root of 2 times, uh, or square root of 2 dt. So when we integrate, we'll get the square root of 2 times t. We'll have to evaluate that from 0 to 3. And that's just going to leave us with 3 root 2 minus 0. So our arc length will simply be 3 times the square root of 2.